What's going on YouTube? It's your girl Ro here. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. If this is your first time, I hope you'll consider subscribing at the end of this video. If you've been here before, thank you so much for coming back. I appreciate you. Happy holidays to all who celebrate. So today I'm going to be taking a look at what's growing in my arrow gardens. The ones that I have running at least. I have, it feels like a thousand of them, but I think I only have like six or seven. Uh, in use right now and we're going to take a look at that. I'm also going to be talking about two um, growing challenges that I'm a part of that you guys might want to hear about. So stick around and let's take a look. In this unit I have some uh, red giant mustards and some type of lettuce. I don't know. I don't know which one it is. Kind of looks like a Paris Island cause. Maybe. I don't know. But I plan on um, pulling these out and putting something more interesting in. Starting some more lettuce, of course, uh, because it grows so fast. But then putting something else in there. I don't know what, but, you know, maybe... I already started 42 day tomato. I'm thinking pizza pepper, put a pizza pepper in here and some lettuces or some chives. Okay, did you enjoy that? I hope you did because those are about the only live plants you're gonna see in this video. And I have a good explanation for why that is. And truth is the answer is because I planted my stuff late. I didn't do it till yesterday. Listen. <clears throat> so I'm involved in two challenges, right? I'm in a um, cucumber growing challenge, hydroponic cucumber growing challenge with a Facebook group that I belong to called, I think Arrow Gardens Cracky and Hydroponic Fanatics, I think. And then I'm in a um, winter indoor growing challenge, which is the hashtag wig2022 um, hosted by GT Junior Grows It Alaska. And uh, that's the one that I didn't start on time. I was supposed to start it on December 7th and I didn't start it until December 20th. Whoopsie. But... I'm going to make up for that by planting something because it's only for a few months, right? Like it ends on March 15th, I think he said. Um, <clears throat> and so what I've done is I've planted something that I think should be come to fruition in that amount of time. And so what I planted for the hashtag WIG2022 challenge is I planted a 42 day tomato. So we shall see what kind of results we get. Uh, I should have a red, red tomato before March 15th. No problem. Um, so that's, you know, barring everything goes right. <laughs> but we shall see. All right. Um, okay, let's go take a look at these things. All right. And here I have, what did I plant? Huh. Oh, coxcomb. Pretty sure it was the coxcomb. It's red. It's beautiful. Um, I didn't know it was edible. It makes a great tea, supposedly. So, there's that. Here, same thing. I just now planted this one up. I got some lemon balm. I tried to think of things that my cat wouldn't eat because this is easily acceptable, accessible to her. The bed's right there and she would be up on this. So I'm thinking lemon balm, rosemary, and lavender. We'll see. Over here is my cucumber growing um, seedling. 
This is a Green Fingers. I started on 12-4. It is not looking good. <laughs> uh, we are not off to the greatest start. Uh, hoping to reverse that. Uh, I got some Lemon Drop Marigolds in these other two spots. Because um, I just wanted to put some beauty around too. You know, if I'm going to use these, then um, I should have some pretty stuff. And, you know, Marigold uh, Blooms are great for teas so i use it for that as well but um if you saw some of my videos from indoor growing last year uh, the lemon drop marigolds were absolutely spectacular they were they jumped off the canvas so to speak i mean they were just so beautiful so amazing and uh so i want to i want to bring that back and I'll put it in here with this Green Fingers Cucumber that is <clears throat> wish I had it, wishing that I had a different plant mama at this time. <laughs> Alright, in this unit, this is the one that I'm doing my hashtag uh, wig2022. Um, winter indoor growing to, or 2022 challenge uh, with GT Junior Grows in Alaska. And I planted, um, I missed the date. We were supposed to start on December 7th, I believe it was. And I started, I planted mine on December 20th. But I should be able to come to fruition in the amount of time that's left between now and then. So a viable candidate there still even though I'm two weeks behind everyone else and then I also planted some Asian Celosia uh, it was just really pretty uh, I got the seeds from Baker Creek and um, I said that you can use it in tea as well so we always like when things are double duty right and that's gonna be one see how I like it Okay, so I'm trying to keep things, you know, well-rounded, right? So you saw that I had um, some greens and stuff planted. I'm going to be planting a pepper. I have um, some tomatoes going, the 42-day tomato. I got flowers going. I got cucumber. So in here, I got more tomatoes. Um, Tiny Tim, just two of those. And then um, some dazzling blue kale right here and some black seeded Simpson lettuce here. And all of that was planted on the 20th, just like so much of uh, the other stuff you saw tonight. Um, this is not part of a challenge at all. This is just me growing things that I know I wanna eat. So we'll follow the progress of all of these over the course of the next uh, several months probably. And uh I'm looking forward to it. It's really fun when you do, um, you know, quick succession plantings of things like the lettuces and whatnot, because, you know, you can change it up. And so you're not constantly having the same thing. You're not always putting up the same content. But um, even if you were, it would still be okay, I think. All right, this is the unit I have at my office. And I just planted this one up. I did three Thumbelina zinnias in there. I couldn't find my usual deck for this, so we're using the sea starting deck. We'll see how that goes. But uh, recently I received this from a client. That's a little plant thing. And I decided I had money plants, so I planted those. All right, that does it for me this time around. I hope you enjoyed the video. Things should get more interesting as time progresses. Until then.